OCMU is a working class community. At this present moment, a lot of unemployment. The community itself faces a lot of issues with the youngsters being on drugs, gangsterism. Apart from the minority who's doing all the bad things, the majority of people are good people. Dominic, when he took over the club, his focus was volleyball um, and the development of volleyball on the school's level. When Dominic decided to have the club reopened, the players were so excited, they were overwhelmed. We've always been volleyball players and volleyball players from Oceanview. It was always a goal of all of ours to then come back to the community and re-establish the club to its full strength. The Ocean View Volleyball Club started to get the youngsters off from the streets. Volleyball saved me. We could be talking about this now, but it's probably saving someone else out of their misery. The place we live in, yes, it's great and everything, but for a teenager there's also a lot of temptation. Volleyball actually meant everything to me, because if it wasn't for volleyball, I wouldn't be the person that I was, that I am. It has a great impact, but only if it's taken seriously. Dominic played volleyball for Ocean View and then UWC. Throughout UWC, he uh, was um, noticed. He also played Western Province, schools, and for the South African National Volleyball. At times, I asked him if, Dom if volleyball was your wife, so I don't know. <laughs> like, uh, it was just everything. On Friday, I just came from hospital, the Thursday evening. I gave birth to our little baby. So I'm actually expecting a call from him now to tell me, come to my house, we need to celebrate the birth of my son. So the Friday evening, he asked me if he could go to the Girls River Sports School. And it's on his way back from the Western Cape Sports School, where he tragically uh, passed away in a motor vehicle accident. I didn't want to believe it. I couldn't believe it. I said, Dominic would never leave me and, and my children. Joyce was just born. He would never, he would fight. I told my mommy he won't. Total shock, disbelief. At this funeral, there's about a thousand people from Ocean View, from the whole of Cape Town, South Africa, even people flew, flying in, the national people that knew him. That's the, the impact he had on whoever met him. The reason why we decided to keep on with Ocean View is to keep his legacy going. I'm also raising two sons, and I would want my sons to do what their daddy done and to continue that. Dominic was the one to drag me back into volleyball because I like threw him my, my shoes and I was like done. And I do believe he achieved it because there's so many young players in our club currently. And that's what he wanted, he wanted the youth to also take part in this and experience things that he experienced as a youth himself. He had that energy, that magnetism that brought people together. He left that legacy and he left them with the tools to continue what he did. They are just continuing it. We want to allow volleyball to save someone else by continuing Dominic's journey that he started. It's fulfilling to see these kids um, prosper in the sport and then eventually in their personal lives as well. I knew what volleyball done to Dominic. Throughout the club, they'll be able to accomplish anything. That's what my husband believed, so why not? These are South African heroes.